Hello, fellow projector or lover of a projector in human design. How do you market your business as a projector in human design? Now, if you're anything like me, when I found out I was a projector, I did not like to be told that I needed to wait for the invitation. And I didn't get this thing called inner authority. So I'm going to give you three invitations. I'm making you three invitations that will, if you accept them, help this business and marketing thing become easier for you. Now, the shortcut in human design, as I see it, comes from following your inner authority. Because if you listen to this wisdom inside you, this intelligence that's been with you your whole life, it will tell you everything you need to know. And you can actually forget all about the things you're supposed to do and what anybody tells you it means to wait for the invitation. So these three invitations for you hinge upon this. Here's the first. Whatever you're doing in your business, dear projector, slow down. We tend to move so quickly in what we do, mostly because of the pressure in our minds, which is reflected through the words and actions of people around us in the business world who are also doing that pressure. Give yourself permission to slow down. This is going to help you hear and feel and know that inner authority and what it's telling you, regardless of your type of inner authority. When your mind is quieter, when you have fewer thoughts running through it, that's when that connection to what you know to do is deepest. So this is going to also help you with your energy levels. You know how they tell us that as projectors, we don't have the ener energy of generators to go, go, go. Well, part of what we waste our energy on is all this thinking and overthinking that we don't need to be doing. So when you slow down, you have more energy to do the work and the play that you actually want to do. The second invitation, create and enjoy your life. You do not need an invitation to create what you love to create. If you love to write, write. If you love to do art, do art. If you love to garden, do garden. Enjoy your life however you love to do it. If you're an athlete, go do your sport. And in particular, if you do this in communities of people who also love these things, it positions you really well to get recognized and invited. Because when you are doing what lights you up, you are radiant and people will see you. It takes care of that whole recognition invitation piece right there. You'll also have, again, more energy. When you are enjoying your life, you have energy to do what's yours to do. The third invitation is to give yourself permission to experiment. Now, Ra, the creator of human design, spoke to this all the time. It's not enough to know these things. You need to experiment with them and discover what's true for you. So take the pressure off to get it right. Even deliberately allow yourself to fuck it up. I have, I have created experiments where I deliberately did it the wrong way to discover for myself what that felt like. Create your own experiment. What would you like to explore? What would you like to discover? What would you like to try? And then see what happens. Notice what you learn. Get quiet and listen to the wisdom within you, to that inner authority. This this is the secret to thriving as a projector in business. This is the secret to thriving in everything you do in your life. And this will never let you down. I have a few more resources for you. If this has been helpful, I'm going to post below this video a playlist that's just for projectors, a playlist about my thoughts about how to transcend your human design, especially if, like me, you're kind of frustrated by the perceived limitation as well as my workshop, Marketing for Projectors, which includes specific examples of marketing strategies that work best for projectors. 
and answers some of the biggest questions that projectors have asked about how to market their businesses. If you have a question, please post below. Please like and subscribe to get more like this, and I hope to see you soon.